Hi, John. Hi, Brian. Hi, everybody else who's looking over this proposal for Buy Rochester and how do we make it profitable. Since I'm emailing over a proposal, I thought it might make sense to just walk through some of the most important characteristics. I won't bore you and I won't make it take too much time. I think, you know, we had a meeting here a few weeks ago, the last part of April. It was April 29th. And in that meeting, I think there's one thing that I didn't make very crystal clear, and that is the first step in our work together for Buy Rochester will be to determine a profitable way to implement a Buy Rochester campaign. So as we talk about the creation of a marketing plan, the purpose of that marketing plan is to explore all the different avenues and the different steps that are needed to be considered in order for Buy Rochester to in fact be profitable for the Rochester Area Chamber of Commerce. I've sent you over uh, with this email an attachment of an Excel spreadsheet that has an outline of the work plan. In addition, I have also sent over the total contract for services. The work plan articulates step by step what we're going to do, how many hours it will take from each area to do that. So I just want to explain the, the flow of the work plan so you see what that looks like and then what the total cost is. Then the contract for services shows you our approach in more of a partnership with the Rochester Area Chamber of Commerce. What we would like to do is we would like to be able to uh, move forward with the creation of the marketing plan, do all the necessary research, all the steps that are needed, filtering out of miscellaneous ideas on what will make this the most profitable venture and opportunity for the chamber and make it a visible campaign in the community, the By Rochester campaign that is. So this, the work plan at the top, you see results, and those are just the things that you need your marketing department, us, market, to achieve for you. Then under that, you have solution, that's self-explanatory. Those are the, the steps that we need to take in order to achieve those results. A description of the solution, those are written in conversational form, so I'll let you read through that. Over to the right is your marketing creative strategy. I just want to explain those for a minute. Marketing time is a marketing gal or marketing guy. That's your project manager's time. That person is billed at a rate of $85 an hour, and each of the, the uh, quantities in the spreadsheet are in terms of hours. And then you have creative, and then you have strategy. So as you take a look through the work plan, I think the most important thing for you to understand is that we market will be developing a marketing plan which gives us the absolute best opportunity to achieve profitability with implementing the Buy Rochester campaign. So you've got the itemized work plan, you have the overall contract for services where we're paid a deposit and then a commission. You guys can take a look at both of those. I imagine you'll have many questions. We will be here to answer them. I thank you so much for the opportunity to work with the Chamber of Commerce and each of you and look forward to hearing back from you as you have questions and we're ready to follow up. Have a great day.